Hey everybody, Pup of Day, just coming back at you from my primary location. How are you doing tonight? Um, I look like crap. Pardon me, I look like crap. I'm unapologetic because I get things done. Uh, oh, oh my god. So anyway, let me take off my headset. Let me take off my everything. Let me freak out the dog while I do that. Um, okay, so, um, previous videos I talked to you about having the pump and having the, uh, the big, um, big fan, the big rug fan for helping clean out the basement. The other thing I had was a shop vac, which was clutch in getting the stuff from the back of the basement and the corners of the basement and from under the racks that I had and under all of the stuff. Uh, so vacuuming that water out and putting it in the cellar hole. So uh, that's what I had uh, also done. And I did that most of it before my brother got here. And I was so proud of myself that I got most of the water out of the basement. And like, this is, you know, it happened on Monday night, on uh, it's Sunday night, and I still have, I'm still finding patches of water under bins and boxes and stuff. So that's where we are now with the water. So uh, the day after my, my brother got here a little Wednesday night. And uh, so Thursday morning, we assessed, we looked. And that's when we said, okay, we're going to separate stuff out into keep and throw away. And we're going to hire two kids. Okay, so I say kids are the graduated college kids um, to be our uh, toters. So basically, uh, we got a 30-foot dumpster. And what we did was we uh, basically put everything in a pile. The kids got here the next day, which is the next day I'm going to talk about, to bring everything up and tote everything and put everything into the... Um, put everything into the dumpster uh, and they, I have a little hill so the basement doors are at the bottom of the hill and they went up all the way around the house and started putting things in the dumpster so oh, yay. Um, one of the things I do recommend is bug spray so when I did all of this and did all my carting and toting and everything uh, I had bug spray on and that alleviated a lot of the mosquitoes that you're seeing me bat away now um, so as I said before in my previous video, uh, you never know what's on what circuit, even though the uh, breaker box is labeled, uh, because you have more outlets than breaker box. Uh, so basically, uh, we found out the hard way that if you plug too many things in, the breaker pulls. So we had, it ended up, we had that big fan, uh, the big fan, the shop vac, uh, a little fan, uh, plus I guess the uh, the uh, whole house air conditioner and my mom's oxygen concentrator on the same circuit. And when that blew, we could flip the circuit back on and take take and redistribute uh, power and, and not use everything at once. But the air conditioning system is shot blown and I don't know what's wrong with it. And um, so that has to be diagnosed. Uh, for the big things that uh, we looked at and drained, we drained the water from out of the old washer and dryer <laughs> that's downstairs. Uh, I had put them as a prep. I had put them up on uh, two by sixes. So another one. Sorry, fighting off mosquitoes. I put them up on two by sixes, and the two by sixes uh, got them up, and they were only submerged four inches of water. <laughs> so uh, we got them up, dried out the the vacuum hose right out. They're still not right but I was able to start doing laundry. And um, since mom is dementia, we have to do laundry, we have to do bed sheets, we have to do uh, fitted sheets, bed sheets, all the stuff that she, um, the, all the stuff that gets dirty really easily when you have a dementia patient. So uh, that washer and dryer, I have no idea if the furnace is working. Somebody is coming next Friday to uh, tune up the furnace. So we'll see if he can even get it started. It's the same company that that um, that tunes up the uh, whole house air conditioner. They can look at that at the same time. Um, I had my chest freezer in there with a quarter cow, and we drained that out, and that's working for now. Um, I don't know how long it's going to work, or if it's going to burn out, or if it's going to. Yeah, I don't know uh, if it's going to be good or not. The, we had we dried out the um, what is it? The uh, the dehumidifier was in there, and we had to take the bucket at the bottom of the dehumidifier and empty it out. <laughs> so uh, that looks like it's okay, but I ordered myself another whole basement dehumidifier just to just to to hedge my vet bets because I'm not here a lot of the times when it's running. So uh, I'll, so that's a thing that runs a lot. So I ordered another dehumidifier. It'll be here next week um, or this coming week, hopefully. 
I had ordered uh, construction bags and um, and you know kitchen kitchen washing dish gloves and dish detergent and uh, all-purpose cleaner and uh, I had mold uh, some mold so anti-mold solution in my basement I used that up I uh, I would I wash the floor down I wiped the floor down with a mop in the bucket which also decided to float <laughs> in the flood I wiped it down I used the shop back the shop back I used the um, the, uh, the the big fan to let it dry and then I it says on the instructions the anti-mold stuff says apply directly so I splashed that on I took a sponge mop and I just scrubbed it in uh, to try to get the mold all you know keep the mold under control so that's what we did um, so yeah we'll see what happens let's see if I have a furnace um, let's see if I, they can resurrect the almost brand new air conditioning system uh, there's a pump that uh, pumps the moisture out of the air conditioning condenser system and pumps it out. It was going for a long time in the floods, but it, that conked out in the middle of the night, so I'm not holding out hopes for that. Um, so yeah, I was like checking out appliances, seeing if they work. Uh, I was so afraid that I was going to use lose all my appliances, all my uh, hot water heater. Hot water heater still works, thank goodness. Um, so the rest of it, we'll see what, what happens. So that was assessing and starting the keep and throw out piles. So, okay, so my dog is digging under the fence, so I better go. All right, uh, I will, I'll uh, uh, do another video on the next day of cleaning up and mitigating and the SHTF of the floods. All right, take care. Bye.